Hi, in the previous video we've learned how to scan a target for vulnerabilities with a WASP ZAP scanner. In this video we'll know how a database can be broken with SQL injection. So, in this video we'll discover what is SQL injection attack, how much harm a malicious hacker can bring to your assets with SQL injection, how to learn SQL injection in depth. First of all, what is SQL injection? For the sake of brevity, I would say SQL injection is called injection attack on a database. There are different types of SQL injection, but all of them consist of three steps of implementation. On the first step, a hacker tests an asset for vulnerability for SQL injection, and then, if he finds out that a target is vulnerable to SQL injection, he moves to the step 2 and executing SQL injection and penetration into database. And after that, when he is inside the database, he can do everything he wants with your data. He can manipulate in them and even destroy them at all. And again, why SQL injection is so dangerous? I am calling only three main reasons here. First of all, a hacker can steal personal data of your clients. And it's obviously that you can be sued and fined for tremendous sums in that case. Also, he can change and manipulate data in your database. For example, if you are an online shop owner, a hacker can change prices on your commodities and your financial loss could be catastrophic, not even speaking about reputation. And of course, a hacker can totally destroy all your data in the database with a couple of commands. So, it's obvious that everybody should take care about protecting from these disastrous scenarios. However, learning SQL injection in depth requires a good piece of time. That's why it's out of the scope of our course. There are books and courses totally devoted to SQL injection, and you can try them to go deeply under the hood. Also, this OS website is a good place to start. But I want to make my course really practical so that you will be able to use new skills right after you have seen the video. That's why in the next videos I'll show you some techniques that let you check your asset for SQL injection vulnerability. So, even without deepening in details, you will be able to find vulnerabilities before a malicious hackers comes to attack. In this video we will learn what is SQL injection attack, how much harm a malicious hacker can bring to your assets with SQL injection, how to learn SQL injection in depth. In the next video, we'll discover how to provide manual testing for finding out SQL injection vulnerability. Let's move ahead. 